Spine belly. You might stop breathing if you got bitten by this snake. Sea snakes are some of the most venomous snakes in the world, and I've heard there's a big population of them in the mining town of Weeper. They are a bioindicator species here, which means their presence, or lack of, can help a scientist to understand more about the health of an ecosystem. This is especially important for an area undergoing mining development, like Weeper. Ah, well, Lauren, how are you doing? Good to see you. Good to see you. How's Welcome it going? I'm teaming up with Lauren Dibbon. She's the local expert on sea snakes, and her work collecting data is helping monitor the health of this rapidly changing Great. landscape. Our spotlight, so we'll make sure this is working. This is the boat we're going to take out. Yep, she's good. With the kit all set, it's time to get in the boat. To handle snakes this deadly, we need some protective gear. There's one snake bite kit in here. Yeah. Just use these cut off wet wetsuit sleeves. Yeah. As just a bit of a barrier. Because these are highly venomous snakes. Awesome. Absolutely yeah. pumped. <laughs> Our number one tool, the spotlight, just fails on us on the last moment. Light comes down, we need the spotlight, it's not working. Absolute nightmare. Oh, woo! So I'm so happy <laughs> to see a light go on. <laughs> We're ready to go. And it isn't long before the first snake arrives. Snake! Got it. Whoa. Hey, this wow. is something cool too. Oh, this is really cool. Pretty sure this is a mosaic sea snake and I've never caught one of these myself. Now we have to take the data. Lauren is logging the GPS coordinates of the snake. She also notes the species and the time she found it. And she's checking for anything unusual about the snake. Oh, this is amazing. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. And that paddle tail is what's unique to sea snakes. That's their adaptation to be able to swim in the ocean. Well, the first sea snake, and it happens to be one that Lauren's not even found before out here. So this is a really special snake. Alrighty. Back into the wild. Oop. Snake! Whoa, beauty. So that's a spine belly, and it's a juvenile one, so it's quite a pretty So this is the common one. one? Yeah. This is our second species, a spine-bellied sea snake. More venomous than the mosaic snake, and more common around these waters. This one seems to be really common, especially in this river. These ones get a lot bigger. We tend to think that up here seems to be like a nursery area for these species and some other species of sea snakes, because you find a lot of juveniles, and only occasionally an adult, like a really big female or something like that. The nurseries are incredibly important to sea snake health across Australia. Several different species from the ocean come to this very estuary to breed. And seeing this snake today confirms to Lauren that the estuary is still healthy enough to support juveniles. If Lauren were to see less of these snakes, it might indicate that the health of the ecosystem is being impacted by other factors. And the night isn't done with us yet. Oh yeah, it is a snake. Snake. Whoa, what have we got? I think we got a file snake, is that? Yeah, file snake. So it's a non-venomous snake. Yep, that's a non-venomous one. Check it on the top. So that species is a little file snake. We've got two species of file snake in Australia. They're both non-venomous. This one's not actually very closely related to the other sea snakes. No. It's so cool, what, tw 20 minutes of just going around here, we found three different species three of snakes species. in the sea. Like the, the diversity is just like absolutely amazing, really is. There's at least 14, maybe up to 16 or more. Very little work's been done, so there's every chance that there's new species to be discovered in any of these rivers. There you go. If the development around the mining does start to impact on the waters around here, 
sea snakes around Australia will be affected. And Lauren is the only person up here doing this. The rain has come in absolutely soaked. It's time to call it an evening. We've got so many snakes, three different species. It's been an amazing experience for me. And wow, I'm so pleased that we managed to get some of these sea snakes today. Awesome. Thank you for coming out. <laughs>